snowplow I found out because that government client I mentioned before. Here's a, this is how basic we get with government, right? This is a really ba uh, this is an event that's happening tomorrow. I got to fly out tonight to manage it super early in the morning, uh, West Coast time. So this is just a JW player on a web page. And if we go in and look at the source on this, I'm just going to show you some snowplow code real quick. It's not going to be the best zoomed view here, but I'm going to right here. So we've got. Um, and notice they call it a collector here. So this little JavaScript snippet here is all for Snowplow. I'm not going like, to go through all the stuff that it's doing, but it's really basic tracking for this page so that they know how many people are coming to this page. It doesn't necessarily track the clicks of this video. I, if, if they hired me to start getting involved with their Snowplow setup, I could probably figure out how we could start tying more events into it. Uh, since they already pay for a license to JW Player, JW Player gives me an easy way to access events that are happening on that stream, and I could uh, potentially tie them into Snowplow. If you're interested, uh, again, all these links will be available up on the uh, PDF, but Snowplow Analytics is available on GitHub. If you look at the tiny URL, it's just github.com slash snowplow. Uh, and they've got a collection of repositories. They've got the server side stuff. They've got a JavaScript tracker, uh, Android tracker, you name it. They've got uh, some stuff built around it. <laughs>